Yo, it's that Nez. Drop another quick review on y'all. This time, what we're gonna be doing a review of is the BAM. This is the Life Gear Light WRX M2 USB rechargeable um, utility carabiner key ring. Um, let's try to shorten the name up a little bit. The uh, Light WRX Carabiner Keyring. Uh, so uh, by Life Gear. Um, I did another review on another one um, a little while ago. I'll put the links in the description of this bad boy. Um, this is a little bit too big. Um, so that's the reason why I checked out that one. Now this one's a little bit more expensive, but it also does a little bit more and it's also rechargeable. So with the one that I currently have, it looks like with the flashlight that's on it, when the battery runs out, um, there's supposed to be three little batteries you can put in there. I don't know where to find them, but I don't have to worry about that. With this one right here, I can just recharge it, plug it in, recharge a little bit, and then it, uh, it's supposed to last a while. So let's get into this bad boy. Okay, so this is what it looks like on the front. Bong, that's what she looks like right there. Nice little presentation, nice and black there. On the back, got some information on it right here. Slotted screwdriver, Phillips screwdriver, LED light, stainless steel, bottle opener, can opener. USB micro US micro USB charge port reinforced polymer king ring attachment specifications LED light one hour quick charge LED light three hour runtime so you charge it one hour and it'll run three hours you know continuously blades 1.75 um, inches so that's under the three inch length for New Jersey um, so you can carry this around unlike this one right here I believe the blade length on this one is just over three inches so technically i'm not supposed to have it but you know it's one of those situations i guess but um um there goes your little warning right there for the focus in a little bit bong if i can get the focus in all right cut hazard warning there goes your address and contact information should you need to contact them you know i like to show you that and there goes your barcode. And um, I don't see anything that says made in China. So could it be uh, American made? I don't know. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause it. I'm going to open this bad boy up to get into see what we're working with. Okay. When you open it up, you got the USB cable here. It's a really short one. Looks like it's only like three or four inches, maybe six. And then you got the device here. Press the button here. USB light comes on. Nice clicky, you know, probably can't hear it that well because it is raining outside. That's what the blade looks like. Feels like it's kind of sharp. Um, how do I close the blade? Does the blade just close? Okay, so it's one of those blades that snaps open, snaps closed. Doesn't have one of those locks. Got your little flathead screwdriver right there. You can put it in that direction also either direction lock it like that like that lock it down there goes your Phillips right there 90 degrees 180 degrees bong lock it back down got your carabiner situation here so in order to use the carabiner you got to have these up carabiner for keep in mind people I'm doing this one-handed see um, does the carabiner open up? I'm trying to see. I don't know if it does. I don't think it does, so... That's weird that it doesn't open up. A carabiner clip that don't open. It's unusual. Um, here, let me pause and try to figure it out real quick. Okay, there is no way to open up the carabiner port portion, so I'm, third, I'm a little disappointed there. Uh, there should have been a way to open up the carabiner portion there, but there is not. There goes your bottle opener. I didn't show you that before. Um, I got everything coming out, all the things, so you can see everything. Um, and then the LED light. So, and there goes your key ring portion attached to your keys. So, I mean, for the price, this bad boy is like 20 bucks. Um, I don't think it's worth it for the price. Maybe if the price was maybe like 10 bucks, maybe 12 bucks tops. 
because you're not even getting the carabiner, which is one of the reasons why I bought it, so I could throw a bunch of, throw some keys on here. You know, as you see with the other one, it's big and bulky, but at least it has a carabiner and it has a carabiner lock on it. So, so as you can see, I could put more keys in there. I mean, my keys, I got the big rings on them, so I can slip them on there. But for other people, they may just have those little small rings, the little small circle rings like that. They may not be able to, you know, get that on there. I mean, that's just me. So I'm going to say, I mean, for what it is, it's a good deal, but only if, I mean, for what it is, it's a good item, I should say, but only for what it is. Price-wise, it's not worth it. Um, if they drop the price down, if they drop the price down at least five, six bucks, then maybe I can see, I could justify getting it only for the fact that you could charge the flashlight and uh, you never have to worry about the flashlight uh uh, dying out, you know, at least unless we get with an EMP or something like that and we get sent back to, with, or we lose our grid and we can't charge it. But other than that, you should all, you should never have a problem with the light. Um, so I'm going to say for the price, um, I would just get with this one. It's a little bit bigger and it's only, this one was only, uh, 11 bucks. Um, but if you need something small and compact and you're willing to pay a little bit more for it, then by all means get that one. But if you're just looking for one, I would look I would look somewhere else. But if you like this style, and let me get it's good quality. It feels really good in the hand. Giggity. Um, it's nice and compact. If you if you if you, if you if that's what you're looking for, that's what you need, then by all means get this. But I would at least try to find it for a, a lesser price before just paying the 20 bucks that's on Amazon. I'll put the links in the description where I got it. And um, if I can find it somewhere um, less expensive, I'll put that link in there too. But um, so I'm that Brenda is, and this has been the review of the Life Gear um, USB rechargeable uh, carabiner key ring, uh, multi-tool key ring, whatever. I'm that Brenda is, and I'm out this piece.